Hey guys and welcome back. In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can enable the 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi that is available in your router. So let's go ahead and proceed. Click on the start menu and type run. Open an application and in search box type ncpa.cpl and then hit the enter key. Now choose your Wi-Fi network, right click on it and choose the option properties over here. Now here click on the configure option then choose advanced app. Here you need to do few settings one by one. So follow and watch this video carefully because if you skip you may end up losing or you may end up without getting your 5 GHz network. First of all under the property section the first option is of 80211ABG wireless mode. Here make sure you choose the option dual band ABG. Make sure you note it down the number. That's why I keep telling these numbers every time. Now in second option which is 80211AC. Here also make the option as an AG as it is. Now thirdly is preferred band. Click on it and under the value choose the option prefer 5 gigahertz. After that hit the ok button. Now you can see the Wi-Fi is not connected that means it will try to connect with 5 gigahertz network like it is connected right now. Now if this settings doesn't work out then again go to the properties section click on configure and this time choose the driver tag. Here if rollback driver is available over here choose the option rollback driver else if it is not available click on the option update driver. Choose the second option browse my computer for driver and again choose second option which is let me pick from the list of available drivers. Now here make sure you choose the driver from your manufacturer website for example my manufacturer bluetooth manufacturer is of intel so i'll choose the intel which is the first one to enable 5 gigahertz wi-fi in my system and click on the next button to continue this will install your network adapter and it will help you to enable 5 gigahertz wi-fi in your system now make sure you go ahead and restart your system and this way it will enable your system 5 gigahertz in your pc now if this method if both methods doesn't help you to get or doesn't help you to enable 5 gigahertz then you need to make sure that 5 gigahertz wi-fi is available in your system for that click on the start menu and type cmd run cmd as an administrator now here you need to type net ss space wlan space show space drivers and then hit the enter key this command will show you if your system is capable of 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi or not. Here you need to choose the option or find the option which is radio type supported. And next to it here, here are the various bands available to verify that your system is equipped with 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi or not. Now here is the point. Here I will provide you the alphabetical words only. If your system supports only B, G, or n point that means your system is only capable of 2.4 gigahertz however if your system showing the symbol a the symbol ac that means your system is capable of both 5 gigahertz as well as 2.4 gigahertz wi-fi that means now you can easily enable your system to 5 gigahertz now if a and AC is not available in your Windows PC in your system that means your system is not capable of 5 GHz and you have to stay on to 2.5 GHz else you have to buy a USB or any other dongle to get 5 GHz Wi-Fi working in your Windows PC. Hope this video works out for you friends. If you are new to this channel click on the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon to continue receiving updates for my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.